Hey, Sean Jantz here, and I want to highlight <clears throat> a pretty big opportunity that came our way this week. And I kind of want to show you how it was formulated, kind of the anatomy of it, you know, kind of how you, it's so, so important to uh, see these types of opportunities, and you got to capitalize on, on them. So on November 18th, I put out a video to everybody, and I highlighted, and I said, market opportunity coming. I said, don't you dare miss out on this. This is how you make your money on Nadex, in my opinion, right? I know a lot of you have jobs, you can't day trade all day long. This is how you make your money. Here I am, November 18th, letting everybody know our, um, our the daily chart on the S&P 500 was insanely overbought, right? And you can kind of go back and watch this and you can see me telling everybody like, hey, we need to sell this chart. Get on top of this chart and sell the crap out of it and you're gonna do really, really well. That's how I've made the bulk of my profits uh, is by selling over bot charts. And you can kind of see me there, right? I mean, I just salivate uh, when I see daily, daily candle sell triggers. And if you go in here and look at what ended up happening, I mean, just perfect, right? I mean, you just get up above and you sell up above of where market is likely not to go right it's pretty easy you just grab your weeklies get up above the market right here i i got in the two two one nine and a half i went a little bigger than i normally do 200 300 dollars whatever right who cares about the money you can make as much money as you possibly want to on these moves they're the simplest easiest things to do you don't you can you don't need to day trade all you need to do is find overbought charts like this I'm always here to help you. I'm warning you. I'm warning you days in advance before it even happens. Every evening, I was letting you know. Hey, I posted exactly when I entered that trade. By the way, so that you can get in these with me and you can see these opportunities. But you cannot miss out on daily candle sell triggers. You get roughly three to five a year, and this is how you make your money, right? And so that honest, that's just one trade. I made multiple trades this week, sell trades this week so far, right? I just sold retracements, sold retracements and made, it'll be a little over $1,000, $1,500 a week, which is a good week for me. And then not on top it off, I'm also in traditional options. I'm short on traditional options as well. So I got money making all over the place on this uh, weakness that we've seen this week. And it was clearly, clearly the simplest thing to see coming. And you've got to be able to capitalize on these. Um, and if you're missing out on this, it's no wonder you're not staying profitable because this is where your profitability comes from. Hey, last night in the trade plan, uh, this is on the uh, small cap 2000. I pinpointed all the levels to trade yet last night and you can kind of see me, I, I pinpointed value area high right there as a potential selling opportunity. You can kind of watch me draw this live, right? And I said, boom, right there. We need to be looking for our sell triggers. Uh, right there at value area high. And if you look at what happened today on the small cap 2000, I mean, it was just unbelievably, I promise I don't move these things. It's unreal. Your mind is gonna be blown when you're gonna be able to see just how well this stuff is. It's amazing how well this works. Price goes literally to the absolute tick to value area high and just massive, massive move down. So much opportunity. Look at that move down. Um, over uh, 28, uh, 18 points right there from there to there. I mean, uh, again, I mean, more than likely you're not going to catch all of that. But here's the cool thing. Every evening you're always going to know exactly what to do. There's never going to be any guesswork. If price goes here, you do this. If it goes here, you do that. Never any guesswork. It's always that simple for you. In the training center every day, you're going to learn, in, in the training center, you're going to learn how to use this uh, on the BTG charts, you're going to learn how to use this gray value area box. Here's the number six way to profit from this box. It says, if price comes outside of value and then it comes back inside and holds higher lows on a one minute or a five minute chart, there's an 80% chance price is going to go up here and, uh, and touch value area high. Okay, so we learned that concept in the BTG training center. Let's go and look at this on a live uh, example. Okay, here's the Dow Jones Industrial Average. This is a one minute chart today, okay? We're inside value, then we come out. Then we get back inside. So we just, under, we, we learned the 80% rule. So what's the first thing we need to do? We need to get back inside and then what? Hold higher lows, higher lows, 
right? Then there's an 80% chance price will run up there and touch value area high. You'll always know exactly where to enter and where to take your profits with these charts. There's never any guesswork, okay? The next concept that you'll learn is the number one way to profit from that box is to look for selling opportunities at value area high right there. So do we look for opportunity sell triggers here? No. Do we look for sell triggers here? No. We wait and say patient and we look for sell triggers at value area high. So we make our way up to value area high. So now what do we do? We look for sell triggers. Now if we go to our 30 minute chart, look at this. This was just absolutely beautiful. Now we're at value area high. We got resistance to the left. We're right there. We got a 30 minute candle sell trigger right there. I mean, just absolutely insane. You're always gonna know where to sell. You're always gonna know where to buy. You're always gonna know where to take your profits. I ended up catching this move. I sold the 19, zoom in on this. I sold the uh, 19,220 for 23 and a half. And um, I took three, four contracts. So I'll, made, I'll make a little over $100 on that. So I sold the 19, price level, 19,220 daily strike. So we were at value area high, 30 minute candle sell trigger was forming, right? There's, we're overbought. I'm just using everything I'm learning in the training center to make winning trades day in and day out. And I'm sticking to extremely high probability levels on the chart. I entered, I'll show you my entry time. It wasn't perfect, but um, notice that we came up, right? And then we're hitting lower highs. Right, so there's a really good lower high, lower high. So you could have entered either there or you could have entered either right there and then just took that sucker all the way down. So very simple, 80% roll to the upside. Then we're at value area high. Now we look for sell triggers. Our 30 minute charts overbought. Now we write it all the way back down. Very easy. You're always gonna know what to do, what not to do. One of the other concepts on the value area is what it's so great because you're always gonna know where to sell and where to buy, always, right? And you just let the chart come to you. And one of the four ways to profit from this box that's on your chart is if price comes outside of value and then it starts to, now what do we do? The number four way, what this teaches us is that we can potentially look for a retracement and look for sell triggers right there at value area low, right? So I wanna show you this morning what happened on Slash, uh, on Slash ES, the S&P 500. So we come outside of value, we're here. Now what do we do? Where do we look for our sell triggers? Okay, let's look at that picture again. Uh, here's the sell value area low, number four way. It's obvious, where do we look for our triggers? Where do we look, do we sell here? No, do we sell here? No, where do we sell? Right there, look at that, that is unbelievable. Literally to the tick, it holds, it holds right there, 21.98 and a half, you have almost 10 points worth of profit all the way back down to that minus 0.5 uh, deviation. And now I wanna take it even a step further. You might be thinking, Sean, that's great, blah, blah, blah. Here's the deal. It was all pre-planned the night before for you. Exactly you know, what to do and where to put your targets. So you can see me here last night telling you like, hey, these bears get after it and, we st and, we f and these bears show some strength to the downside, right? And then we hold lower highs I even circled the target for you right there, circled it. And I told you, right there is where you want to take your profits. I, I, I even write down TP. So every evening, you're always going to know what to do. You're always going to know like where, where to put your profits, where to put your stop losses. Everything's pre-planned for you. These charts are unreal how amazing they work. And um, the more and more you watch and trade, you're going to, you're going to be able to uh, see these visually. And... Um, it takes roughly you know, three months, to, but every single day, you just start visually seeing this and you're gonna be able to catch these moves. Everything's pre-planned, so that's cool. You visualize the trade before it even happens, so that way, when you come into your trading day, it's effortlessly on how you enter and how you exit.